the question that people usually ask in 60 seconds, what are the good things that can happen uh, because of this or that technology? And my advice to all students is that first and foremost, look at the laws of nature and look at the laws that govern the behavior of this planet. And one of the most fundamental laws that governs the behavior of this planet is that all mass of any ecosystem stays on the planet and only infrared radiation leaves into the cold universe. That has some very direct implications in terms of how ecosystems behave. They recycle all the mass and the mass of, of everything they use and there is no waste product. Waste is a human concept that is actually completely foreign to nature. And so from that point of view, if you look at the net primary productivity of the planet, um, which is half of the gross primary productivity of the planet, it's been con a constant measured by satellites over the last 15 years. It's about 110 megatons of carbon. Half of it is used by plants to grow. The other half is used by the inhabitants of the planet to live. In the end, what's left is zero. So when it comes to biofuels, that zero cannot be exchanged for 500 or 1,000 exajoules of energy per year because it is impossible. And that's what I want you to understand.